name is Jill Kiros. I've been a CNA for quite a few years now. I started when I was in high school and I've been with Passages Hospice for two years. When I was 16 I started, I had a car accident and there was a certain nurse that kind of stuck out in my mind that made me decide that I wanted to be in the healthcare and the nursing field. When I couldn't do things for myself, it helped a lot to have somebody do it for me and it made a difference. And I just wanted to make a difference in someone else's life. And it feels good to have somebody compliment you on the job that you do. So it's, it's rewarding. Uh, not a lot of people would think that, but it's, it's a rewarding position. I like it a lot. I'm Tiffany Boyd. I've been a CNA for almost 12 years, and I've been with Passages for two years since April. Well, my mom was diagnosed with cancer, and um, she didn't have very good care. So some of my family had talked us, me and my sister both, into becoming CNAs. So she passed away almost 10 years ago. My mom was mistreated, not only you know by another hospice company, but in a hospital. And ever since then, we always have been more empathetic with the family and the patients and the residents at homes and um, more passion. A lot of people don't experience it the way we did, I don't think. We were young. Um, I was 21 when my mom passed. My sister's 22. So she's like my best friend. We work side by side. Um, she's, I think, been a CNA almost seven years. And we worked in the same home and we worked as partners. and. A lot of those people are the ones that voted for us that we've talked to because they've seen our care, they've seen our work. And, you know, it's nice. Being a CNA is very physically hard. It really is. Um, emotionally hard. You get really attached to some people even though you try not to on a personal level. It's just impossible. You know, it's human nature. And it's, it's very hard. Yeah, I'm very empathetic. Um, I can put myself in a lot of the families shoes when it comes to dealing with the care and the situation. Um, you know, I, I am passionate. I, am, I care about what I do. I get up every day looking forward to going to work. We get a lot of thank yous and um, sometimes in the home that I work at, we get thank yous from family members that aren't even ours that see the care that we give to some of the other patients that we have there. That's always nice that other people recognize that we're there and what we do. It's a very rewarding job. Physically, it's a tough job. Emotionally, it's a tough job, but it's very rewarding. I'm proud to say that I work with Passages. <laughs>